what you see here is my semester's worth of, uh, of work and my self-defined exploration. This semester I just kind of wanted to look at how I could make furniture that's a little bit more interactive. The surface is continuously changing, um, especially on, on this one. Uh, it's sort of left in a different orientation every time someone sits on it and kind of moves around or whatever, and when they leave, it kind of changes the pattern slightly. So I ended up deciding to do a bench for an indoor space, could be a museum, art gallery, anything of the sort. My piece looks at taking the seats and uh, angling them towards each other to encourage conversations between people who might not have had one otherwise. This class is one of the few opportunities that we have to not just design things, but make the things that we've been designing. This class has been really great to get that experience of building it and having a tangible object at the end. Well, or, so originally I started out by looking at how I might be able to create a piece of furniture that would attach to the human body. And so that could extend out and you could walk and this furniture would become part of you. But um, it was a little bit too conceptual and I was looking at how you might be able to take that idea of furniture being parasitic in that way and bring it to something that could be more practical. As they said, uh, when you have to deal with all those constraints, you know, the trick is to hold on to your initial design intent while the form evolves based on those constraints from, you know, from making a real. It's amazing how original the ideas continue to be.